The Quirk Quarp outpost. The Netra tribe first beat this into shape. Let's see. You know boy to check Says they've been waiting for you to help them liberate the outpost. Just keep going while you can and don't stop until all outposts are under your control. There is a high boom team ready to help with taking over that outpost, but it seems their arc shooter is. Seems happy to hear the arc shooter will be dropping high booms down. Get up there and get fixing. Just a few moves left. Make them count. A few moves left, make them count. Just a few moves left, make them count.
all fixed up. Shooters are already gearing up the high booms. Hope their aimers are fixed too. The outpost belongs to your tribe now. He says you made them weaker, but they won't give up. Your Sifu thanks you. Your tribe is growing stronger. He says you did a great job capturing the outpost. You're one step closer to end. Says you. Let's see. There's the sovereign who runs this outpost. He didn't expect his outpost to be invaded, but now that you're working with their rival, he can... Needs a logical reason for him to surrender the outpost without a fight. Strong arming won't work. You'll have to fight for it. It's their last line of defense. Once their guardian falls, they'll surrender. Outpost belongs to your tribe now. He says you made them weaker, but they won't give up. Your Sifu thanks you. Your tribe is growing stronger. He says you did a great job capturing the outpost. You're one step closer. Says you didn't...
Let's see. Says it's time to set the outpost free. Inflict as little damage as... Here's the first line of defense. That's a bomb lobber. to get a barrel out of it, then hit it toward the gate and blast it. That looks splody. Shoot it and watch it blow. Not too close, though. Give it another try. Here's the second line of defense. Smoldering already. Give it a good smack. Give it a good smack.
Almost there. The outpost belongs to your tribe now. He says you made them weaker, but they won't give up. Your Sifu thanks you. Your tribe is growing stronger. Thinks you did a great job capturing the rival's third outpost. And they all hope you can... They've been waiting for you. Taking control of this fort will bring peace between your tribes. You better be. A tribe's fort is a bigger challenge than an outpost. The plan is to fling you over the wall with a sling lobber. However, he wants you to secure a hard hat first should anything go wrong. It's better you go and find one for yourself. It can't be too much trouble, though. It's one size fits all. Heads up, that's Peak Spot, a great place to watch the world from. Who knows who might be watching you? Seems the keys need to be in sequence to make the ringding a work. Just a few moves left. Make them count. The technology from yesterday's is still here today, even if its message is getting old. It's time to set the rival tribe free. Inflict as l You need to unite the tribe.
That's a fire starter. The dry grass looks like it would ignite easily. You just need to create a spark to light a fire. It burns brighter than the light. The battering bonker looks like a great way to get through the gate. Bet you just need to knock and it'll open up. That's bonkers. Netratride values liberty and is striving to protect freedom. They want to continue with each tribe being responsible for their own and believe that uniting the tribes is the only way you can survive. He was hoping it wouldn't end this way. There's no reason to fight instead of uniting. It would be fighting over nothing. He thinks being likable isn't enough. If fight is all you do, he can't stand by you. He won't be charmed that easily. You'll have to fight for it. The rival Sifu is defeated, and the destiny of their tribe is in your hands. You are free to choose their fate, but not free from the consequences of your choice. He'll leave it up to you to decide the fate of the rival Sifu, but suggests you be merciful. Do good, and good will follow you. Thinks it's a good gesture to offer support to others when you can see that they need it. And with that, you're spinning your own fate, good or bad, never to be undone. Side by side they'll stand until order and stability is reinstituted. He's gotten news that the other tribes have realized there are no winners in this war. There's no purpose in antagonism. The way he sees it is that you've been forced into opposition. Your tribe didn't start the war, but it's fallen to you to end it. It's clear your efforts have been successful. There's light at the end of the tunnel. The tribes are tired of war and will remember the one who brought them peace, whether you decide it'll be now or later. So, do you want to end the war now or continue the crusade? I 
responded well, Papa. Full of mother teeth. He agrees. Better save your energy for something meaningful. It's the Netra Claw Chain. As long as you're happy about it, 